Well, good day to you wherever you are. You join us on a day where the weather just may have an impact on a football match that has been uh, much anticipated. It's dry at the moment, but the forecast is that it will be wet, perhaps very wet by the time the game is uh, underway and certainly by the time of the second half. The crowd, though, are here and they are in good form. There's a right old cacophony going on. The atmosphere is terrific and kickoff is moments away. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. The information we've been given is that they're going to go with a 3 5 2. It's a setup that's been enjoying quite a renaissance in recent times and one that complements the counter attack very nicely with two strikers, two wing backs, and potentially two runners from central midfield. You can understand its attraction because it really can get the numbers into the opposition's box and equally it can get the numbers back into your own. There's the whistle. Aimed long and direct. Over to the left. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Battles to win it back. It's come loose. Gets into some space. Chance, is it in? He scored! First blood drawn. Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. It's a good foot in there. Oh, that's a foul, free kick's been given. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket, it's just a stern lecture. Just whacks it away. There has been just the early goal here, and it's 1 0. Caps it out. That's not going to make it. Tries to stroke it through, and it's got through. It's a busy front line, uh, lots of movement. And is that working for you? Well, not really. To be honest, I, I'm not a great fan of taking goal potential away from the penalty box. And the shot! Lingered over it, and the chance to counter had gone. Well, the whole idea of a good breakaway is to leave the opposition struggling to get back, and they were just too slow. Chance to break. 
gets it back. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. And he's away. Can he score? Sticks it away. They are right back in business. Oh, look, it's always great to see a solo effort with a goal. It's the ideal combination of pace and control. That has certainly made things interesting. Look, this is not for the faint-hearted, Peter. This is hard and fast football. Trying to play it through. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Forward it goes. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Tries to get it forward quickly. Has a hit! And in it goes! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! Well, I think there's a few trying to claim offside, but he looks to have been on. Yeah, he was on. So we have a breakthrough. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. It's got through to him. It's good distance on it. There is the half-time whistle. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. And we are up to the break. Oh, what a half. It's, it's been pulsating and totally absorbing. We're actually headed for a, a potential classic if this carries on. This is insanely good. Here we go again. So, 45 minutes to turn it round. Forward it goes. Barnetta. A goal. Aimed long and direct. He's picked him out. And it's hoisted clear. Forward it goes. He wasn't being fooled. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. He ran himself into trouble there. Free kick given away. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card.
brings it out wide. Crosses in a low one. to safety well it's good stuff this is better well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it isn't it Jim spot on Peter it's on a plate this could fall anywhere He's lifting it over. And he just whacks it away. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Going for goal! That really should have hit the net. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. going to be a change now with the ball out of play I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away but the manager has, has done him a big favour I think by, by taking him off, you know he was looking very very leggy hoists it high here it comes he's tried one oh, should have been the equaliser when it needed something decisive, he showed too many mixed signals. It is looking like the end. If anything's going to happen, it's got to happen now. All they need is one big chance, and it may do the trick. Barnetta tries to get it forward quickly. But there's going to be another change here. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Time is ticking away, and they're playing as if they're defending a lead. They've got to get it up the pitch. Just brushed off the ball there. It's a great gallop down the right-hand side. Oh, he's for can he finish? It's broken loose. Aimed long and direct. And that's that. Quite a game. Memorable for its fluctuation in fortunes. An astonishing turnaround. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? It can be difficult at times playing in front of your own fans if you're not living up to the expectations. And I think with confidence looking a little fragile at the moment, they were playing not to lose more than trying to win, and I think everything was just a letdown because of that. My thanks to Jim alongside me, and as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you.